Good afternoon, Stephen from SJC Landscapes. We're on the final day of our latest pond build. Here we've got our Aquascapes Upflow Wetland. It's seven meters by five meters, about a foot deep in the middle of it. Planted up with all these native rushes and grasses aquatic species from our wetland we've got a split waterfall and then flows into an eight meter stream and then into our main pond which is 17 meters by nine meters uh, this was supposed to be a four week build we had rain every week for a day or two so that put us back about a week and a few extra things to do during the construction of the job as well so about six weeks here so we've got our tree stump tree root there with split waterfall coming out of the wetland into our stream section here a few stepping stones across the stream and then down into our main pond area. We like to put sandy beaches in a lot of our projects, so the clients asked for a beach entry, sandy beach entry. Down there is about 400 mil deep, so you can just swim right up and it's a nice little entry and exit point into the pond when you want to get in and get out got an intake bay over in that corner as well as four jets so one jet down here pushing across the beach another one behind that rock on the framing the beach over there We've got our waterfall pushing out that way another jet to the beside that over there pushing over to our intake and then our final one over in that corner pushing across had Kai and James helping out on this project massive thank you to those guys for helping bring this all together Luke came down to help dig out and a few days at the end so we've got our main waterfall out of the pond there that's about 800 high about 600 wide and we've got about 600,000 litres an hour going over that we've got lights in underneath the main waterfall a couple of lights in the stream one lighting up that log another couple of lights lighting up these framing rocks on the beach Lights all throughout the pond, down in the deep section and across these shelves. Created these big stepping stones so you can walk across the intake bay which will help with maintenance. So this is our intake bay area. Pumps are located over in our pump house. drawing from about six or seven hundred mil beneath this water level and all that water that's coming over that waterfall is getting pushed by the jetting down this end of the pond and sucked into this intake bay so it's about a meter wide by two meters long huge area for any leaves, any debris which lands on the pond surface to get sucked into and kept in here. The owners can pull that out by hand or net it out. Got a big log tree stump in under there, under that shelf. It's about half a meter deep. There's going to be some water lilies around that so it'll be a really nice habitat for the fish to hang out. 